M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Just a quick one here on the BT01 Bluetooth microphone. Now, if you want that to be sh to show up so you can reprogram it using your CPS software, of course you can program it using the handheld, go into the menu, go into the settings as normal, but if you want to use the CPS, what you're going to need to do is go Tools, go to Options, and make sure in the options you've ticked Bluetooth and Bluetooth handset. So when you do that, I mean, we've got APRS as well, analog APRS, we've ticked all that, GPS, I mean, it's such an amazing radio. Click OK, then go back to optional settings, and this time, when you go into it and go across to BT, look, you've got all the functionality and you can change all these settings in the BT01 microphone you can see on the right. And even the, even the on the here, you've got short press, and on this radio, you have the PTT, and underneath the PTT, you have three buttons, program one, two, and three. So you've got short press, long press, and it looks like there's a, a secondary long press as well. That will give us nine programmable keys. You've got mic gain, backlight duration. Look at this one here. You, you can choose on the up, down. It can be volume or it can be channel frequency. That's the, that's the buttons on top. The middle one is the power. You've got another one here for RX noise reduction. That'll be interesting. TX, BT syn synchronization. I don't really know what that is. Off or on? I mean, do you have to turn it on? I'm not sure. Bluetooth synchronization. Maybe if you've got a headset and you're using the microphone, you need to synchronize all that. Otherwise, you get like a weird feedback or something. But I think I think it's well worth knowing this because um, you know we need we want to know we can just sit at, sit at our computers and program our BT01 microphone using the software. We don't want to be sitting there fumbling with a handheld um, for so for so long. And also this way all the settings get saved and you can then send it to the radio. Now, remember, there is a USB cable that is connect that does connect to the BT-01. So I, w I would like to know is, can that be used for programming, for programming the, you know, these settings or, you know, or is it automatically just sent to, from the 578 to the BT-01 in the big main co-plug? So 73, thanks for watching my channel. Catch you all now, all the best.